Blessings to all my viewers and subscribers. Thank you for visiting Blazing TV. Please remember to subscribe at the end of the video. People, a Dominican Republic national, a young girl, had been murdered in Jamaica. Dominican Republic national shot dead in St. James, a national of Dominica Republic who works as a bartender in Little Pot, St. James, was shot and killed while on her job. This happened Thursday afternoon. The disease has been identified as 37 years old Maria Isabel Valdez Benz, who resided locally in Little Pot, St. James. She has been living in Jamaica for the past four years. Reports are that about 5.30 p.m., Benz was at work at a bar in Lickapot. Residents reportedly heard a loud scream, which was followed by a loud explosion. The police were summoned, and Benz was found suffering from what appeared to be gunshot wounds to the head. Benz had been taken to a nearby hospital where she was pronounced dead. A motive is not yet established for the killing. Now people, this is really sad. She is not a national of Jamaica. She is from Dominica Republic and her family stays in Dominica now and hear this sad news. This is so, so sad. I don't know, but there's some demon or something running around in Jamaica. Every day, there's a lot of killing been going on, a lot. Now this recent one. The police has said there is no motive. They don't have a motive for the killing as yet. But you know how it is. People in the area know what's going on. But if their life are being threatened, they're not going to talk. But they know what's going on. They know how it go down. They know. But they tightly. They won't say anything. But this is really, really bad for her. She been living there four years. I guess she loved Jamaica, so she tried to ban with Jamaica. And then she working in that bar only six weeks. Only six weeks she been working in that bar. So what have, could have gone wrong? Only six weeks? And I wonder if she been living in Little Pot for the whole four years or what had happened there? But... <laughs> Only God knows, and the residents, they know, but they won't talk about it. I must say condolences to her family and friends, and hope that they will investigate and solve this crime. When one even is a, a different nationality, even the locals, you got to be careful. You got to be careful who are the persons you, you befriend. You have to know how to protect your life, especially in Jamaica. They heard a loud scream, and then soon after they hear explosion. Yet, 
They don't see anything and they, they can't say anything to the police. Oh, they won't say anything because they don't, they don't want to lose their life. But people, this is sad. This is another day of another crime in Jamaica. Bless up yourself. Remember to subscribe.